What up, my beautiful people? Welcome to today's vlog. How's it going? I just finished up a nice little lunch with my friend Kurt Hugo Schneider. Maybe you've heard of him. He's on YouTube. If you haven't heard of him, please go check out his channel. It's amazing. You will love it. YouTube.com slash Kurt Hugo Schneider. He's a music producer and songwriter. Um, can't remember if I've told you or not. We went to college together. We were in a band together. We worked together for about a year. We lived together for a year and a half. Um, we are homies. And he's, a, he's an awesome dude. We were just kind of catching up. Um, we're also in another band called Nerd Alert together. That's with Hus Husky Starcraft. Anyways, Kurt's a good dude. A old, good friend of mine. And we were just getting lunch, catching up, talking about YouTube, talking about music, talking about um, life, uh, love, success, work, food eating some delicious food. He's a big fan of Asian food, so we went to go get some uh, ramen. Not the kind that you buy in the store, but the kind that you get served at the restaurant. Because the stuff that you get at the store is not real ramen. Do y'all know that? I did not know that for until I got out to Los Angeles, and then someone took me out to a real ramen restaurant. And I was like, what? This is amazing. This is so much better than my microwave dinner meal. So if you don't know that that exists out there, you should go check it out. Look, look up a ramen place in your local phone book and go check it out. It's, it's hot, delicious soup with lots of veggies and meat and noodles. Um, I got I got pan-fried ramen and, today and it was delicious. Chicken, soy sauce. Was it soy sauce or was it a teriyaki sauce? I can't remember, but it was amazing. And uh, I'm very satisfied after it. Anyways, it was a great lunch with Kurt and uh, I really liked eating to see him. I hadn't seen him in a couple months. So I really enjoyed getting to catch up with him. Um, and he's actually going on tour pretty soon in July. Him and Sam are going to be going on tour. Uh, Sam just released his uh, first debut full album, 14 tracks. And Kurt was a producer on all of them. And what are you doing, box? Don't run around. Sit down. Put your safety belt back on. What are you doing? Gosh dang it boxes these days. You can't count on them for anything. They're always going to misbehave in the back seat. Look at that box. Look at that box. Look at that box. Can you see it this time? Making sure I don't hit my neighbors. I don't want to run them over. Um, yeah. What was I just talking about? I forget now. Debut album, Sam. It's out. It's on iTunes. Go check it out. Sam Shuey, T-S-U-I. Uh, it's kind of pop, dance pop, upbeat. It's good stuff. And uh, it's lots, lots of good songs on there. I think my favorite is probably the lead single, Me Without You. It's a good song. It's a good song. Um, yes. So that was really, it was a great lunch getting to talk. We, we like chilled for like two hours, almost over two hours, like two and a half hours. Um, he's doing very well. And uh, got to tell him stories and adventures about what's been going on with us, you and me, you and me and us, us and me, us and me and you. Um, so now I'm going home to work on stuff, videos and whatnot. Um, but tonight I have my improv showcase trying to parallel park right now. I'm doing a little U-turn in the street. Hold up, hold up. Just look up my nose for a little bit. It'll be, it'll be fine. Now let's park and pop you in the case. Boom, boom, done, done. Um, tonight is a comedy showcase, improv show. I'm gonna try and get it recorded if one of my friends can record it. Then we can have something maybe to put up on YouTube if anything's good. If anything's not good, I'm probably not gonna put that part up. But if there's some good sketches and stuff, you know, we'll, we'll do it. Um, then tomorrow, I think we're gonna go see Star Trek tomorrow. Star Trek comes out this week. Hey yo. We're supposed to go see it on Thursday, but that they moved they have some release dates on Wednesday now, so I think me and the warp zone guys are gonna go see that. So that should be fun. That steering wheel's in the way. Don't don't look at the steering wheel. I feel like we should I should get I should move it over just a little bit so it's like not you don't have steering wheel on like part of it, you know, maybe. I don't know. Possibly. Mm. Um Thursday's a live stream. If you want to come check out the gaming live stream, we're going to be doing it 6 to 8 p.m. West Coast time. And, um, 
yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be fun. What well, I did something else this morning. No, I didn't. I didn't do anything. That's pretty much it. Shh, shibbity shop. This is a, I'm gonna just gonna keep this real quick and short. Had a great lunch with Kurt. Uh, getting all sorts of lunch and meals and coffees with friends, and it's it's going well. We're I'm just catching up with people, reconnecting, and uh, you know it's good to talk to your friends. It's good to check in with them, see how they're doing, be like, "Yo, what up, G?" And you're like, "Yo," and you're like, "Yeah, let's go, let's go meet up, hang out, do whatever." And they're like, "Oh my God, this sounds amazing. Let's do it." And then you do it, and then you're like, "Hey, by the way, I'm working on this thing. You want to be a part of it?" And then they're like, "Oh my God, yes." By the way, I'm doing this thing. You want to be a... Yes. Oh, yes. And then you just... Good things come around. Good things come around. I invited Kurt to come over to the next Game of Thrones night. There's a group of us who watch Game of Thrones every week. So he should come over to that. See some great TV sh show-ness. I just started watching that recently. Do you guys watch Game of Thrones? What TV shows do you watch? Game of Thrones is probably the only one that I'm watching right now. Because I don't have cable, and I don't watch TV. I watch YouTube videos. I'm in the next generation. Get on my level. That's good. Uh, but Game of Thrones is cool. You know what else is cool? Google Glasses. Google Glasses are cool. Check it out. Check it out. Can't see that. Google! Bam. I'm going to wear these glasses now. Feel like oh you know what I'm gonna go I'm gonna go work out today for the first time in a long while I'm gonna do this thing called the seven minute workout Have you guys heard of it it's like a full body workout in seven minutes I I don't know I know it's amazing right it sounds amazing I agree with you it is completely mind blowing thank you you understand me but it's apparently seven minutes you do each exercise for like thirty seconds and then you rest for ten seconds in between each exercise and you rotate it so like you do like you do a different uh, muscle group alternating. So like, I'll do squats. This is just an example. I don't think this is in the actual exercise. I do squats, and then I do push-ups, and then I do crunches, right? So like the squats work your legs, and then the push-ups work your chest and arms, and then your crunches work your abs and your back. And then you go back to another leg thing, so you do like lunges after that. And so it gives the muscles, because you're just gonna do it high intensity, you're gonna do as many crunches in 30 seconds as you can do. And then you're going to take 10 seconds to rest. And then you're going to do as many push-ups as you can do. So then while you're doing that, your, your legs are going to be resting and, and like catching a breather, a breath. And you're going to be working your chest as hard as you can. And then when you do the crunches, your chest is going to be like catching a breath. So you can work these exercises and these muscle groups in really high-intensity formats. And apparently it's backed up by science, too. They're saying that doing this seven-minute workout... The evidence from like some national health institute is saying doing the seven minute workout is the same as like spending an hour and a half at the gym in terms of muscle stuff and calories. So I'm going to try it out. I'm still going to do my other stuff, but this is my first exercise back. So it's, I'm, I'm so excited. You guys don't understand. You don't understand. I have not worked out in a long time. And for those of y'all who don't work out regularly, you're probably like, what do you, what's the difference? But for those of you who feel me, and who like go running regularly or try to hit the gym when you can, it just makes you feel so good. It makes you feel, you just, you get all the stress out, you create a lot of endorphins, you sweat toxins out of your body, it makes you feel good, makes you look good, then you feel good about looking good. So I just, I mean, I've been doing all right, but I'm so excited. I'm worried about my back, but we're gonna be all right. We're gonna be okay. We're going to do this. It's going to be fantastic, all right? We're going to have a fantastic time. It's going to be seven minutes of pure intensity. Burr. Anyways, that's going to be it. No, we're going, to make it to, we're going to make it to ten minutes. We're going to make it a ten-minute video. All the other ones have been like eight or nine minutes. We didn't make the double digits. we got to make the double digits. You with me on this? Thank you. Thank you. I knew I could count on you. I knew it. What else can I tell you about? Um... Star Trek's coming up this week. I haven't seen Great Gatsby yet. Don't know why. Because I haven't had anybody go see it with. That's why. So hopefully that's coming up. Um, and let's see. I met with a friend. We talked about... Oh, I got this. I, I'm going to be making an Animal Crossing video. 
Those of y'all, did I tell you about this yet? I can't remember. I'm going to be making an Animal Crossing video. I'm going to start planning it today. Probably shoot it next week. Probably upload it either later in the week. No, actually, I think it's going to be uploaded much later. i got to get it approved. It's an official Nintendo thing. Shh. Nintendo's, Nintendo is involved. They're, they're helping me out. So uh, i got to get it approved by them, and then I'll get it up. And that'll go on the main comedy channel. Um, but that's exciting. Hey yo, Animal Crossing, it's a video game where you get to run a town. I think it's like the Nintendo version of, like, they may not want me saying this, but they haven't said that I can't say it yet, so I'm going to go ahead and say it. It's like the Nintendo version of, like, The Sims or SimCity. It's called Animal Crossing. And you basically, you grow, you create a town. There's a little bit of a town already there. You come, you're, you're the mayor, and you run the town. And you talk to all the people, and you help help them out, you engage with them, you build them things, you do things for them. You build the town. You you run the town. You're the mayor. You're the boss. You're the top dog. And uh, and it's fun. And um, there's some other things I can't tell you. I know I can't tell you about certain things. So I'm not going to tell you about them. But there's some cool new things about this version of the game. So you should go check it out when it's released. I think in June. I think it comes out in June. Um, so put that on your list. Uh, I'm going to create another video about this later, but what games are you excited about? I, I don't know that many games coming out in the next, like, three months. Like, the rest of May, June, and July, I think there's, like, only Deadpool. There's only the Deadpool game coming out. Then, like, August rolls around, you get a, a couple more. But I really don't know many of the games to be looking forward to. Which is fine, because then I'll just focus on indie games, and that'll be totally cool with me. But, uh... Yeah, what games are you looking forward to? I really want to know when the next couple Wii games are coming. Wii U games are coming out because I really want Wii U Fit. I'm all about fitness, you guys. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I apologize for wanting to be healthy, but I'm just I'm gonna have a confessional here. I like fitness. All right. I'm sorry. I know I'm weird. You can judge me. Go ahead, judge me. I'm ready. Hit me. Your judging powers are strong. Congratulations. Um, yeah, the Wii U Fit game is supposed, to, is supposed to come out. It was supposed to come out this spring, but now it's just a general 2013 date. So whenever that comes out, bam, all about it. All about it. I was just thinking about it the other day. I think it was yesterday or the day before, about how much I miss the Wii Fit games. There was so many, like the Wii, the Wii Fit board where you stand on it and you like do hula hoops and like balance games. Like, it was so fun. Um, someday. Someday Wii U Fit will come out, and my day will be a lot brighter. Someday. Hashtag someday. Um, mm, yep, yeah, nothing new on the music stuff, because my music producer guy still has to finish exams. But I met up with Kurt. I might try and do something with him. I didn't talk to him anything about it, but, you know, we homies. He'd probably be down to do something. I just gotta bring the right project to him. Um, but we homies. We homies. I put up a picture of us on Instagram, me and him. Oh, there's like three cute dogs. Check out those three cute dogs. Can you even see them? No, if you can see the runner. But you can't see the three cute dogs. Too bad. I got to see them. They're all like little baby chihuahuas or something. But they're running. I don't want a chihuahua. I want a dachshund. Similar, but different. Or a pug. Or a bulldog. All right. I'm going to go ahead and go. Because I got to go to the seven-minute workout and shower and clean up and get a couple more things done, and then go to my improv show. So, uh, I hope you guys have a fantastic day, or evening, or morning, all of the above. And I will see you very shortly, alright? Stay safe, stay classy, see you soon.